Hey, what's going on fam? Welcome back to the FOMO channel. Um, I'm Mr. FOMO himself, and today we get to do kind of do a fun one. Um, so a while back I was uh, just looking at my notes over here. I think uh, it's in here somewhere. I won't go into that too deeply. I I looked at baked beans a while back and then I kind of left it because I didn't, I didn't know enough about it. I was looking into it. And then today I saw Justin Pratt, who, also, who is also one of the guys who's online and he's... I, I respect him a lot because he does do spreadsheets and stuff. And he's um, just like the calculator guy. He's a bit more in-depth in these kind of things, which I really respect as well. Um, I specialize more on journeys. So whereas I will stake into something, then I'll continue my journey and talk about the product for a period, period of time until I'm out of the product. So whereas a lot of the other guys do it slightly differently, they, they put it on and then they forget about it. There's not much of a... They don't really talk about it afterwards. So this is one of the fun ones that I came across uh, looking at a couple other channels as well. I I think this started around November. Like I'm actually waiting to have a conversation with the owner of the brand. I have had him up. Um, his, his name is um, King. His name is uh, the, the Baked Bean guys. Uh, his name is the King Baked Beamer. Bina. Um, so that's quite fantastic. Anyway, before I jump into this one, guys, just a quick bit of house cleaning as per usual. Um, guys, we're in this massive push at the moment for 1,000. It's a 661 already. You guys have been absolutely fantastic, and I cannot fault you guys at all. You have been an amazing community. I, I, I love this community a lot, as you know, through everything I'm trying to do, including the 50 BUSD giveaway. Um, at, as you guys know, you you've got, this is my profile over here. Um, so the winner was five BUSD. So there's going to be five winners of the BUSD. Just so you guys know, I'm going to I'm going to be giving ten BUSD to each winner. Thank you to everyone who has voted for that as well. Please head up and follow me on, on Twitter as well. That's where all the latest information comes out. So going back to the channel again, guys, um, just smash that like button and, and the sub button. Sorry, my apologies, guys. And please hit the notification bell. We are on the big push to one thousand. I, I want to do more giveaways. Um, the second giveaway I'm doing is through BNB Fury. So please jump and have a look at this video here. Uh, the video will be linked at the end as well so you guys can have a look at what i'm doing at the moment um they were kind enough to give me half a bnb to give away to you guys and it'll be all given away to you guys in the conversation you'll also see my conversation with uh with the brand owner and he said you know like it's very very straightforward i'm not making any money however i would appreciate it if you would add me as a referral so i can get something out of it if you don't that's totally up to you but i'll be picking five winners out of that please watch that video to understand the terms and conditions of that one as well Please smash this up. So anyway, let's jump into this fun one. So uh, when I was when I was in, uh, living in Otago at university, which is really far away from here, um, I was I uh, was um, one of the things I was doing the whole time was I was on a, I was on a budget the whole time. I couldn't afford to eat a lot. And I was like, is it, being a student, it's really difficult as it is. You don't get a lot of money. So baked beans was definitely noodles, baked beans, rice three staples that I would go to and I remember getting very creative with baked beans baked beans it wasn't just eating baked beans but being creative with it like eating with, with sweet sweet Thai chili sauce spicy baked beans added with other stuff you know to baked beans on toast baked beans with cheese on toast uh, it, it, the list is endless yeah I should I should write a book about 101 ways to eat baked beans <laughs> would, would any of you guys buy it if you did I'll do it I'm <laughs> just kidding so this one's a fun one so what 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 it basically does with this one here is you get daily return of eight percent of APY of 2920 and there's a development developer fee of three percent now this has been around for quite a long time then in, in this world in the Dow DAP as we as we're as we are starting to learn about Dow's DAPs DeFi and all of these remember all of us are quite new in this area none of us are real experts are we some of us claim to be super experts but we're not I mean there obviously are people who are experts so this they're the ones creating the product because they know about it more than we do but I wouldn't say I'm an expert at all about this um, it is a learning stage for me as well so please take that into consideration when you do comment I may get some things wrong, but some things I will get right as well. So this is definitely a long-term hold and a long-term investment plan. Um, please do your own research as well, guys. All of this is not financial advice. Please really have a look at what's going on in these kind of things um, before you jump into it. And definitely check the contract balances of all of this. Uh, Baked beans, like last time I checked through B-Scan, was around, uh, this B-Scan here, I think, was around half a million. I think, yeah, it's 520,000 in there, you know. Uh, I was looking at, at how it's going. They call it hatch eggs and sell eggs. You sell the eggs. So 
the, the game theory behind this, these guys know the game theory. And, and and the other thing that Justin said as well when I was looking at his thing, and, and I can definitely see that as I, I am part of the Telegram chat, yeah? So if you go into the Telegram chat over here, these guys are, you had me at Baked Beans, you know, like, these guys are absolutely fantastic. They are passionate. They really love their product. And they've been doing this for a long time. So the game theory is really, really simple. You, you reinvest six times and you draw out once. So it's a six in one pro program. Every time, yeah, six, one, six, one, six, one. Now, I, I think this is a fantastic as well, you know, but there's there's a lot of game theory behind this, and obviously there's a lot to do in these kind of things as well. I'd, I'd love to hear your comments on this, if you guys are involved in this project and what the game theory is behind this. So I found I found this as well. Uh, they were kind enough to send me the documents as well. So what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to try and read these documents to you. So... Let's go back here. The Ethios Ed Audit, which is, I think, is a bit better than the... <laughs> I'm not going to say it's better or anything with the other one. I shouldn't really even say that. But anyway, um, so the, the, we're going to go into contents. I did look at the code. So, guys, just to understand, yeah, I'm not a coder. I, I just know the basics only. Uh, a friend of mine who is a coder did have a good look at it, and he couldn't find anything. He said it was pretty solid. It looked pretty solid as well. Once again, a financial advice. Um, so this was in January 2nd. This audit was done in 2022, so about a couple of months ago, only two months ago. Um, to Security-related issues, code quality, relevant documentation, adherence to specifications, and adherence to best practices. I will... You guys can definitely go in here and read that. Um, it is pretty long. <laughs> Low, medium, high, and extreme. Um, the Baked Beans contract has concluded with a positive result. The initial review identified a number of non-critical issues. That's really good to know. Uh, I'm just going to go to issues. So the green, so the blue, low. That's always good. So these were low, acknowledged. Low, 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 low. And then the variables can be declared as constant, uh, missing invent emissions i mean you guys can read it i'm sure you guys there's some of you guys who are a lot better at reading this than i am i mean the key things i look for always is the three percent developer fee and then also if there's a withdrawal fee so what is the withdrawal fee what is the account balance and how long do you think this this will last that's pretty much all i look at yeah uh i do leave the code sometimes when there's loopholes but normally these guys like if ethos is doing an audit it's usually really really good um, and if one of my friends, so now what I'm doing, guys, is because I've been conned too many times in this space, I have been conned a few times. There's times I mentioned in the in the chat, but there's also times that's happened that I don't mention at all, yeah? <laughs> and, that, and it has happened to me. Um, the only thing I can't see is the withdrawal fee. I want to know if there is a withdrawal fee on this. But this is, the key thing is there's a guest optimization issue, okay? We recommend the functions that are never called by the contractor declares external to save gas. Okay, there you go. You can set it up yourself. That's no issue there. Just reading it one more time, guys. I did read it before. Um, so, so doing that, like what it allows us to do, guys, is this project has been set up for longevity. Yeah, they've had it since November. The the, the people in there are really passionate. They've figured out the game theory behind it, and they're all doing it together to keep this going all the time. Now. I'm not sure exactly how they're keeping it going, but they are. They have managed to see November 2021. There you go. Utility contracts. There is a utility to this as well, which is fantastic. Um, most of these don't have a utility contract as well, guys. Yeah. Um, so do have a look at that as well. Revision. So so you had a. I mean, I guess. God, I guess the only way we're going to learn about this is if we go and jump in. So what I'm going to do, guys. I have 1.7 BNB. I'm just going to put. Zero point. Let's just do it. Yeah, ape into this. Let's learn about these things by putting something in. Let's put a zero point two. Uh, let's bake some beans. That's it. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing, guys. They don't call me Mr. Foma for nothing. <laughs> we can all laugh about this later. Yeah. So let's see what happens. So this is my referral link, guys. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add that referral link as well. Now, it's totally against, guys. This is totally up to you guys if you're going to jump into this. But this this has... Oh, you get a shit ton of beans. Oh, God. No, no. Go back. Go back. I want to see my beans. Close. Go back. Go back to my beans. Oh, no. What happened to my beans? Baked beans. Let's go back to baked beans. <laughs> what happened to my beans? So, okay. So you get a whole bunch of beans, yeah? And then... You can rebake them, and you're gonna add the beans. Yeah, you can bake the beans, 
or you can eat the beans. Eat, eat the beans means obviously means cashing out. I imagine it means cashing out. Yeah, there hasn't been any. So I haven't watched any videos on this, guys. I just saw the Justin did it, and I watched like five minutes of it before I kind of lost interest. Um, however, he, he, look, I do respect him a lot. He's one of the better guys out there. Yeah, he does some excellent work. I do like his work a lot. It's just I had other things to do at the time. Um, so eighteen thousand one. 181,000, so the price, I guess that we've got to check the price of beans. That should be the price of beans somewhere, right? I guess we can gamify that. Anyway, so your beans, these are my beans, your rewards, zero B, B, and B. So that will keep giving me beans. I imagine I keep getting those beans. So let's look at it in a couple of days' time and sit back and do another video on this and see where this takes us. And then let's see if I rebake those beans or eat those beans. But we all know I'm going to be rebaking them, right? Because we're going to be looking for the game theory for this. They say you've got to rebake your beans every day, yeah? I'm not sure if it's six times a day, six times in a week. Um, let me figure that out later on, guys. But anyway, we're fomo into this as we usually do, because that's what this channel is all about. <laughs> that's all from me for today, guys. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Um, please hit the sub button, guys. Let's hit that. Let's hit the 700 today, and let's aim for the 1,000 over the weekend and smash it. Absolutely love you guys. You guys are the best. Peace.